All right, we're back now with our series, Money Made Easy, part of our collaboration with CNB Select. CNBC Select. Summer fun isn't cheap, but there are some steps we can take to make and we can save that money. Here to share some of those strategies, CNBC Select <laughs> contributor Brittany Jones Cooper. Welcome you got back, it, Al. Brittany. Nice to be back, Al. Okay, so some facts here. Uh, we'll start at the grocery store. Yes. Bureau of Labor Statistics said food prices raised went up 6.7% between May of 2022 and this past May of 2023. So starting off, how do we make our money go further? And it says not just let's not go willy-nilly yeah. to the store. You got to have a plan. Uh -huh. You got to make a list because we're all guilty of getting in that grocery store and just throwing things right. in the cart. Impulse uh, buy. Exactly. Uh, it's also important to know the layout of the store because a lot of stores will put the best sales in the back. Uh -huh. So next time you go to the store, start in the back, assess uh -huh. the situation before you spend your money in other places. Right. Uh, you should also know that a lot of stores will put the most expensive items on the shelf at your eye level. Uh -huh. So oftentimes you can save money just by looking down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. And what about coupons? Yeah, people sleep on coupons. I don't know. I guess people think they're old fashioned. Come on. But Come I mean, on. if you follow a brand like PNG, mm -hmm. you go on their website, there are massive savings. Okay. There's also amazing apps. There's one called Shopium, and that one it's kind of like a rebate. You send in your receipt and then they give you money back. Ibotta is great. People have been using that for years to get discounts at the grocery store and other places. So it's not like you have to clip coupons anymore. Mm -hmm. There's definitely an app for that. And it, basically, you're talking about the price is right. Look at the price of goods. Yes, if you follow the price of goods, you start to understand how you're spending your money. For instance, we know that uh, last month, or in May actually, the price of meat, poultry, and fish went down. We know right now that the price of tomatoes, citrus, and eggs have gone down. So when you go into the grocery store with that knowledge, you feel a little more empowered, mm -hmm. right? I think so. All right, yeah. Yeah. All right, travel holiday or the holidays coming up. People will be traveling. Yeah. Let's talk about gas prices. How Ooh. to save money on gas. Well, first of all, gas prices are definitely better than they were last summer, but we still want to save. Okay. And I think one of the best ways to do that is to look for a credit card that's going to give you cash back on your mm -hmm. groceries and uh, your gas. Because okay. think about it, you got to buy those things anyway. You might as well get the reward. Sure. So if you're looking for a card, look for one that's going to give you like 3% cash back or three times your points. Okay. That's going to give you the most bang for your buck. And as always, make sure you pay that credit card down every month so you're not accruing your interest. I started doing that because Dylan did. Remember? You were like, what are you doing? It's a game changer. <laughs> um, all right. I said let's it just like that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> it was more like, what are you doing? <laughs> um, okay. You have apps to compare yeah. prices. And also finding cheap gas is how to save money. And so some ways to find it, there's an app called Gas Buddy. Okay. It's going to show you the gas station and the prices around you. Um, there's also one, uh, you go to AAA.com, put in your zip code and they'll tell you the prices. Also, don't forget about those grocery store gas stations. Uh, yeah, sure. you know, they usually yeah. have yep. those fuel saver Program, so you can save on groceries and on your gas. Like so you BJ's about, and Costco. Yeah, you talked about the cashback credit card. Mm -hmm. Use regular gas. Okay, so on a car that needs premium. These are so, no. First, they, no. they don't need premium. <laughs> no. That's, well, that's the thing. You think first, it's a myth? Look, I, I've gone. To, I've had this debate with so many people. Your turn. If you, look, I don't know. I don't you got to go by what your manufacturer suggests. Yes. Right? If the manufacturer of your car says premium gas, sure. But most cars are going to be okay with regular gas. Yeah. For me, I'm not trying to be bougie with my gas. <laughs> if I can save some money, that's how I'm going to save and it. Your car's like, pup, pup, pup. no, I'm you just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's also a good idea to keep your tires inflated because that helps with fuel efficiency. Yeah. And also a fun fact, this isn't every gas station, but some gas stations will give you a discount if you pay in cash. For cash. No, absolutely. Yeah. Especially so yeah. next yeah, time you're there, just go in and ask. All right, I've turn. switched to, pr to regular gas. Yeah, yes. high no five. No problem whatsoever. Save right. that money, Dylan. It's not put putting. Uh, <laughs> okay, online shopping, it's so easy to just spend, 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 click, click, click. How absolutely. can we save money there? Well, the first thing I say, join those rewards programs. I know that when you log on, they're usually offering you like a 20% discount take it and they keep sending you deals and discounts I know a lot of people don't like getting those emails constantly mm -hmm. so I say start a separate email account where you sign up for these reward programs True. so you know where to look for your discounts but your inbox stays kind mm -hmm. of clear you do get, if you sign up for the text messages and stuff you do get a lot of coupons oh yeah absolutely and I think um, also Amazon really quick um, right no yeah yeah. <laughs> Sorry, are we moving? You're moving, so I was oh, moving. I was just going to go on to the next. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're um, fine. She does that from time to time. She <laughs> right? just roams. Just, um, because when you take your family out to, I'm thinking like baseball games and just events where you have to pay for a whole family. Yeah. How can you save money at those events? The first thing you want to do is look for free admissions. A lot of places like aquariums, museums, they're going to have free hours, free days, free events for families, right? Um, I also am a big fan of national parks, and I want to tell everybody that on August 4th, national parks will be free. Ooh. Oh, wow. so if you 
you've been meaning to go there with your family, mm -hmm. make sure you, you check right. that out for sure. Um, also, did you know that you can get a tax break if your kids go to summer camp? What? I did not. So there is no. something called... Oh, you missed out on that. I exactly. Too late. Too late. <laughs> um, there is something called the Child Independent Tax Credit, and oh, what they'll yes. do, they'll cover your expenses, 35% of your expenses, up to $3,000 for sure. one child, wow. and up to 6000 for two children. So if you have a child in summer camp, are you thinking about sending your child to summer camp, keep that receipt and look into it. Wow. Is that That's retroactive? Right. I, I <laughs> and also, if you're uh, over 65, you get a lot of discounts. This is true. That's AARP. It. You're yes. on those? They are AARP. They're already AARP. sending the AARP that's fit right. flyers. Yeah, so. that's, 50, that's 50 and older, so yes. you can save some cash there. <laughs> Brittany Cooper Jones, thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much. Thank Jones you. Cooper, Brittany Cooper Jones, Jones Cooper, Brittany. I kept Brittany seeing Brittany Jones in the prompt. I'm like, not, <laughs> not, not Jones, me. Chanel Jones. And for more <laughs> information <laughs> on the financial tips that Brittany just shared, just go to cnbc.com slash select. We should note CNBC may get a commission for purchases made through links on our website. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.